Hi, I'm Stevie from Spokane, Washington, and I know that some people in this life have the trial of a physical disability. I'm wondering how I can testify of the resurrection without being dismissive of this challenge. Thank you. You know, and it, and it is a little bit tricky because on the one hand, we, we want to testify, we want to shout from the rooftops, yes. right? That Jesus has been resurrected. We're all going to be resurrected. Our bodies are going to be whole, right? Whatever issues you've got, whether it be cancer or physical, physical disabilities, right? Those are all going to be made mm -hmm. whole. We want to do that. But in the meantime, there's so much pain and there is yeah. grief and there is struggle. And, and I think, you know, God honors that in the meantime. You know, think, of, think about Jesus when, when he went to, to the tomb of Lazarus, mm -hmm. um, who he knew he was going to raise from the, from the dead, right? But he wept with Mary and Martha, right? Yeah. It, it, yeah. In, in that moment, uh, it was, he felt their grief and he was with them in their grief. So it's, it's hard, it's tricky, mm -hmm. it's a balance, right? But I think we can do the both and thing. We, we can both absolutely hold on to our faith in the resurrection and yet attend people or attend ourselves if we need to in, in the grief that we have in this moment. That's okay mm -hmm. to, to have that kind of sorrow and grief right now. Yeah.